Hello students, welcome back to my channel Trivisha Classes. I hope you all are fine students. Very nice. It's nice to hear that you all are fine. Even I am also fine too. So students, in today's class, I am going to discuss you about the topic photosynthesis. Okay, this is science, uh, science subject topic that is photosynthesis. Okay, so students, you can see here photosynthesis. Okay, it seems that this word, it looks very um, difficult for you. The long, the word is very long. Even some of them find it very difficult to pronounce it. So, I will make this word very easy and clear to you how we can understand the term photosynthesis. Okay, for that, let's come see on the word, students. See here, photosynthesis. We will first of all see what is the meaning of photo. What is the meaning of photo, students? Can anybody tell me? Okay, nice. As you said that photo means the photo that we click from camera, right? Okay, let's see. I'll tell you photo. Photo means here light. Okay, photo means here light. And synthesis. What do you mean by synthesis? Synthesis means to make something. Okay, to make something. Okay, photo means light and synthesis means to make something. Okay, so students, I want to show you something. Okay, see here students. What is this? What you can see? Yes, this is a plant. Very good. So, as it is said to make something, what to make? Photosynthesis is related to the study of plants that how plants prepare their food. Okay, your mother makes food at home, right? Everyone, your mothers make food at home. Very good. The same way the plant also prepare their own food. So let's find out how plants prepare their own food. What is the process? How? What is the process of make, uh, of plants to prepare their food? First, as you see, what the main thing is here is light. So from where does the plants get light? Yes, very good. The plants get light from the rays, sun rays. Very good. So you can see here students, suppose this is a plant. Okay, suppose this is a plant. Okay, suppose this is a plant. So how plants prepare their food. The first thing is they prepare their food by the help of the sunlight. By the help of the sunlight. Okay. Yes. They prepare their food with the help of the sunlight. Sunlight. Okay. Only sunlight? No. Anything else? Yes. Yeah, mom. If your mother makes uh, food in the kitchen, only she uh, add uh, what she adds. She all adds all the ingre ingredients in the food, right? So like that only the plant also, it what happens? It also needs many ingredients to prepare their food. So the first our ingredient of plant of uh, making the uh, food of plants is sunlight. Next is what? Anybody? Yes, very good. The next is water water is very important okay it is very important for the plants to make their food sunlight and water yes sunlight and water they are the they are the two processes that through which the plants make food okay sunlight water and what students sunlight water and carbon dioxide Okay, carbon dioxide is also very important for the plants to make their food. Now, from where does the plants get carbon dioxide? Can anybody say? Yes, the plants get carbon dioxide through the air. Jo hawa hoti hai, through the air, the plants get carbon dioxide through the air. Yes, very good. And what happens as you can see here in the students suppose this is a leaf okay suppose you can see this is a this is students you see this is a leaf and in the leaf 
they are very tiny 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 particles okay they are very tiny 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 particles like this which is known as stomata what is known as stomata okay the tiny particles that of the tiny pores they are known as stomata as you can see when you will take the leaf okay you can see the leaf it has very tiny tiny pores in it tiny tiny particles in it which is known as stomata and the air that is carbon dioxide is it went into the into the tiny pores and it get the light from the sun and water okay and one more thing is also very important students for the food preparation of the plant what chlorophyll yes very good chlorophyll is also very important for the plants to prepare their food now tell me students what is chlorophyll yes the green pigment of the plant the green pigment of the plant is known as chlorophyll okay so students so you can see here first was our sunlight water carbon dioxide chlorophyll and what students chlorophyll and one more gas is also very important yes oxygen oxygen is also very important for the plant to prepare their food okay so when carbon dioxide and chlorophyll they mix what uh, what is the result when carbon dioxide which gas will form when carbon dioxide and chlorophyll when they are mixed which gas will form oxygen gas will form students so you can see here this is the process through which the plants prepare their food see here sun sun is very important for the plants to prepare their food sunlight water the water is absorbed into the roots of the plant yes so sunlight water carbon dioxide chlorophyll and these are the and oxygen these are all the process through which the plants prepare their food and this process is known as photosynthesis okay the process through which the plants prepare their own food the pro is known as photosynthesis okay students it's very easy and very simple how you can see through sunlight through air through water through carbon dioxide chlorophyll oxygen all these are the different parts through which the plants prepare their own food okay so students i hope this video is very useful and clear to you you have understood the process of photosynthesis that how the plants prepare their food so students if you like my video so please do like subscribe share and do not forget to click on the bell icon to get the further notification bye everyone